Thank you so much for joining this lesson. This is Distinction QBC Assessment Test for Technical Studies, Grade 9. Going to solve step by step as we prepare for the next exam. So this tutorial will help you understand more. Therefore, kindly watch up to the end. So question number one says, complete the channel of distribution for imported goods. So these are the goods which are imported from outside our country. So we have foreign producer. From foreign producer, we have import agent. From import agent, we have a dash there. And then we have local consumer. So from import agent, we have local wholesalers. Then from local wholesalers is where we have the local consumers. So the correct answer for number one is local wholesalers. Number two, which of the following is not a channel of communication? So a verbal is a channel of communication. Chat is a channel of communication. Electronic is a channel of communication. But written communication is not a channel of communication. Therefore, the correct answer for number two is C. Number three, how does a worker ensure safety when using a raised platform? So avoid buying the platform that is not true. Buy the most expensive that is not true. Use the right platform for the right task. That is how you can ensure safety. Use it for the right task. Number four. Which of the following is a type of service? Remember we said service is intangible activity. So which you cannot touch it. So selling food is not a service. You are selling goods. Selling books, not a service. Terraling is a service. Selling medicine, not a service. And therefore, the correct option is B. Number four, correct option is B. Number five, which of the following is an online threat that occurs when one is attacked online by other users? So when one is attacked online, that is not theft. The theft is a physical threat. Hacking. No. What about cyberbullying? Yes, cyberbullying is when one is attacked by another person. Impersonation is where one pretends to be another person, so for fraud or other benefits. Number six, each of the following is not a talent. So we have drawing, drawing is a talent, teaching is a talent, dancing is a talent, eating is not a talent. Therefore, six, the correct answer is A. Number seven, each one of each one best describes an oblique projection. Remember, this is grid nine work. We have where we have oblique projections, 3D drawing. So each one of the following best describes. So all sides are equal, not true. The angle of all interior sides is 90 degrees, not true. The side faces are not visible, not true. A drawing that has a front face that appears in its true size. While well, other faces are slanted or angled. So that is true. And therefore, the correct answer is B. Number eight. Which one of which one is not a class of hazardous substance? So flammable substance, these are hazardous substances, poisonous substances also, corrosive substances also. So the correct answer is large substances. These are not hazardous substance. So the correct Answer is C, number 8C. Number 9, a mainframe computer is a type of a computer classified according to, that is, size. Remember, you can classify a computer using three criteria, that is, size, its purpose or function, then type of data handling. So a mainframe computer is classified according to its size. Number 10, how can we nurture our talents? Relaxing and waiting for a no. Not showcasing, that is not true. Remaining arrogant, no. Practice it every day. So if you want to nurture your talent, you have to practice it every day. So that is number 10. So if you go to number 11, the other side. Two of the following is an example of a career in pre-technical studies. So a farmer, no. That is agriculture and other subject. Lawyer, no. Doctor, medicine, no, that is science. Mason, yes. So the answer is 
masonry that is mason number 12 each one of the following is a safety precaution against online safety threat so you like the word safety precaution so safety precaution covering the computer with a dust cover no that is a physical precaution installing strong password sharing personal information that is not true none of the above not true so the answer is b installing strong password number 13 each of the following is an ethical practice remember we have ethical practices and unethical practices so each of the following is an ethical practice taking performance enhancing med medication no that is not true uh, boasting about your talent not true disrespecting those of low level no the answer is b fair and equal opportunities number 14 each of the following rest platform is most appropriate to use when installing the roof of a house stone going to start with elimination stone not true I'm sorry for that stone is not true about steps steps it's a bit lower not true ladder when installing a roof ladder it can be a bit to be tricky so we need to use stressors most of the workers use stressors to install a roof number 15 what is the meaning of the term ram ram means random access memory that is the answer correct answer rom read only memory this stands for rom go to number 16 which one of the following is a ferrous metal so a ferrous metal means a metal or a material which has iron and some other small component of other element so from this question a ferrous metal it has iron so we can see the answer is c iron number 17 which the following is a method of preventing virus on a computer so how can you prevent a virus by throwing away the laptop that is not true call the seller not true not sharing that not true by installing what you call anti-virus number 18 if the following is not a personal protective equipment used when handling hazardous substances we can wear goggles to prevent our eyes very true we can also wear face mask to prevent maybe the spread of airborne disease and etc we can wear shoe cover to prevent our shoes what about a jacket so it is not a personal protective equipment so jacket is not equivalent. the correct answer is d number 19 what angle is used to draw the lines drawn backward in oblique projection so the angle between the the line and the receding line in a bridge projection is always 45 degrees so therefore the answer is c number 20 so one of the following is not hazardous substance so hazardous substance is a substance that are likely to cause harm or discomfort so each one is not so you can see jig can cause discomfort but sanitizer can cause discomfort perfume sometimes can cause discomfort what about water water is not a hazardous substance so i'll continue with section b Thank you for watching.